do not get started with Comfy until you watch this. Perfect. Perfect. People keep asking me if I'm back, and I haven't really had a good answer. But now I'm thinking, yeah, I'm back. And lucky for you guys, because the Comfy YouTube space these days is a mess. So we're going to jump in and get this situation under control. This is the definitive guide to preparing your PC for AI. Do not install anything until you watch this. You must do exactly as I say or you will end up with a janky installation. You are not going to find a comprehensive guide like this anywhere and especially not one that's going to make things so easy for you. I know because I've learned the hard way. So stick with me and together we will hyper tune your PC for optimum results. The most capable models these days are big. Even if you got a 4090 or a 5090, you're going to need to hyper tune your PC. So no more fucking around. Let's get into it. Before we begin, link in the description over on the Patreon definitive guide. Step by step, we'll walk you through exactly what I'm about to go through in this video. All the links, all the commands, anything you need to copy paste into your terminal, everything is on that guide. So head over to the Patreon, it's free, and get the guide. And while you're there, subscribe. Now, the very first and foremost thing you want to do is install Visual Studio. Visualstudio.microsoft.com, link on the guide, get it. You're gonna click download Visual Studio. You will run it, click continue. Now, when you run this installer, you're going to come to a screen that looks like this. See this, workloads, you're in the workloads tab. This is going to be where you select the packages that you want to install with Visual Studio. You can see that I have several of them selected here because I work with a lot of environments. But the one key package that you absolutely have to have, you scroll down, you will see right here, desktop development with C++. Check that box. Now, all of this is already installed on my system, but if you look down here in the bottom right hand corner, you will see right here where my button says close, yours will say install or download or something like that. Click that and it will install Visual Studio along with that package. After that's done, close it out and do a reboot. Great, you're back. Now the next thing you're going to do is make sure you have git installed on your pc git-scm.com slash downloads slash win again link in the guide this is a standard windows installer click next a few times and you're good to go next you're going to want to get the nvidia cuda toolkit as of today september 1st the cuda toolkit 13.0 is available but it takes time for the rest of the community to catch up so do not get 13.0 get 12.9 this is the one you want developer nvidia.com slash cuda blah 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 link in the guide you're going to click on windows click on this x8664 select if you have windows 10 or 11 i don't know why you would still have 10 the local installer is going to go ahead and download the whole package and then install everything at once the network installer is going to download a tiny package and then it'll download the rest of what it needs as it installs i'm going to go ahead and click the local installer so i get the whole package at once click download great once that's done downloading go ahead and run that click ok here to select the location it's going to do its thing agree and continue go ahead and select the express option this is just a summary of what was installed click next and close next you're going to want the nvidia app nvidia.com slash all that stuff link in the guide click download now once that's done go ahead and run it click agree and continue here's some notes you can ignore that and what you're going to want to do in here is come over to the left hand side where you see drivers click on drivers and here you will see the version of the driver that you currently have installed for your gpu if this is not the latest version then over here on the right where mine says reinstall Yours will say update and you can do the NVIDIA studio driver or you can do the game ready driver. I use the studio driver because I'm more geared towards content creation. But if you're a gamer, go ahead and choose the game ready driver. It doesn't matter which one you use. Just make sure you have the latest version of whichever one you choose. After that's done, go ahead and close that out. And guess what we're going to do? Another reboot. Go ahead and restart your computer. Meet me back here in five seconds. Great. You're back again. And guess what? That's it. That's all you need to do. Super simple when you know what to do. But if you didn't know, that you needed that desktop development with C++ and if you didn't know that you shouldn't get the latest version of the CUDA toolkit you would be spending hours uninstalling and reinstalling things trying to figure out what's wrong ask me how I know so as I said you're not going to find the secret sauce that you need put as simply as I'm explaining it to you here pretty much anywhere else on the internet so subscribe and like the video damn it and after you've done that click the next video because now we're jumping right into comfy and again there's secret sauce you need that you're not going to find anywhere else so I'll see you in the next one. Peace.